Mary chipped her front tooth and the monkey bars acting like an idiot. She made a big scene and had to go get her tooth capped. It looks normal, I guess. Here, give me that. I told you she had a capped tooth. Elm trees. How many pages can you write about dying trees? Here, something about Dominic. Palazzolo jumped off the roof today over that rich bitch porter. How stupid can you be? Today we went out on the boat. It was pretty cold. We saw a couple of whales. Lux leaned over and stroked the whale. I didn't think they would sting so much. It's the kelp in their baleens rotting. I hope we can go again sometime. <coughs> Ten little history yeah. that. Lux lost it over Kevin. Is it Hines? Um, the garbage man. The garbage man. Lux lost it over Kevin Haynes, the garbage man. She'd wake up at five in the morning and hang out casually on the front steps, like it wasn't completely obvious. She wrote his name and marker on all her bras and underwear, and Mom found them and bleached out all the Kevins. Lux was crying on her bed all day. The trees like lungs filling with air. My sister, the mean one, pulling my hair. And so we started to learn about their lives. Coming to hold collective memories of times we hadn't experienced, we felt the imprisonment of being a girl. The way it made your mind active and dreamy and how you ended up knowing what colors went together. We knew that the girls were really women in disguise, that they understood love and even death, and that our job was merely to create the noise that seemed to fascinate them. We knew that they knew everything about us and that we couldn't fathom them at all. <laughs>